talking with her, called and said, I want to give my life to Christ. This lady was speaking, uttering mysteries. Because she came back with an experience. I mean, her bed was vibrating. She was vibrating. I sent the text to a few of the leaders. This is how you know that. I, for me, it was a confirmation. The, the goal is not, okay, dead, raised and all of that. Thank God for all of those things. But for me, it was a confirmation. And then guess what happened? The lady said, one of the doctors came and looked at her. And he said, be careful. And then when she was sleeping in the night, one of the doctors came to her in the spirit to kill her in the hospital. Are you getting my point now? And then she began to pray. And then in the morning, she came and confronted them for her and said, listen, you have not seen anything yet. The lady that put her ears, huh, that put the phone in the ear of the dead girl, was just going to get bridges and return. And a car from their back just smashed that girl. And I heard she died in the afternoon. Can you imagine? Are you seeing that evil is real? For standing to make sure somebody did not die. Our hospitals have now become occultic places. Listen. In my life, death has tried me many times. Are you hearing what I'm saying? So don't you think I'm just talking nonsense? From birth, the devil wanted to take my life. I didn't have the privilege of enjoying breast milk to start with. Let's even start from that one. Praise God. I've been diagnosed of all sorts of things and I've seen the hand of God. Are you getting my point? I have met with armed robbers on the way. Car has jammed me once. So don't think I'm just talking rubbish. Death is a spirit. Tonight, we will rest this issue of death once and for all. Rome, Revelation chapter 6. Hmm. Revelation chapter 6. What is this mysterious phenomenon called death that can scare any man, scares the rich, scares the poor? Accidents, infirmities, incurable diseases, acts of wickedness and terrorism, all kinds of things that just brutally exit people out of this earth. Is there a way out? Revelations. Verse 8, verse 7, let's start from verse 7. Verse 7. Please read. And when he had opened the fourth seal, these were the, the riders upon the four horse. Are you getting my point? I heard the voice of the first beat and he said what? Come and see. Next verse please. And I looked and I behold and behold a pale horse and his name that sat on him was what? So this mystery spirit that has been responsible for the premature exiting of people is not just a phenomenon the Bible tells us that he's a real spirit he sits upon a horse and he does not walk alone hell followed him I told you hell is a spirit are you seeing it there in your Bible <laughs> hmm. and power was given unto them over a fourth part of the earth so how does death manifest? It kills with what? Are you seeing now? Sword is the manifestation of that spirit. And you see that what again? Hunger. It is still the same spirit. And number three, what you now call death. He named the event after himself. And then the fourth part he said, and with the beasts. You know who the beasts are in the earth? It's not just talking of wild animals. This is the terrorism and all of these things you call. He said, and with the beasts of the earth. They are all the manifestation of how this spirit operates. 